Hi guys, it's me, Morgan. Um, this video is going to be just a little bit different. It's just a short little video. Um, I had someone ask if, or not ask, but say they would love to meet my pets. So we're going to do that. Um, but excuse what mess you see. Today is restock, refill, re and clean day. So, um, my house is kind of in chaos at the moment, but I figured I'm here. I'm getting ready to do a Dollar Tree haul. I might as well go ahead and do this too, or as well. So, with that being said, and I have a stain on my shirt, by the way. Just, it's my romping around the house shirt. So, here we go. All right. So, first, we have... Dean. Dean Roo. Sit. Sit. Good boy. Dean. Ah, ah, sit. He's our one year old Labradoodle. Or not Labradoodle, Bernadoodle. So he's a very, very big boy. He's very, very loving, as you can see. Very loving. Yes, yes. Okay, next up we have our four year old Moose. Moose, sit. Ding, quit. Ding, out kitchen. Out kitchen. All right, moose, come. Ah, moose, come. Sit. No, no. Thank you. Moose is our gentle giant, even though he's not as big as Dean. But he is our gentle. Look at him. He's so gentle. Oh, look, Gibby Gibbs. Gibby Gibbs. Come here. That's our cat. Gibbs. Hey. Hi. Hi, baby. Yeah. And his name is from um, NCIS, in case you didn't know. And Dean and Moose, these two, are from Supernatural. And then this little fellow right here, he's fat and roly. Come here, Harley. Is our old man. He is Harley. Yeah. He's our old man. As you can tell, Dean's very jealous. Of everything. Come here, Harley. Quit, Ding. Sit. Sit. No, no, no. And they're hairy right now. There you go. Quit. Yeah, he's a good boy. Yeah. All right. Ignore this stuff. This is stuff I'm doing for the Dollar Tree. But here is Castiel. And Castiel's tank looks empty because he's currently chasing crickets. So, um, that's his cage. I have a bigger one I'm going to put him in when he gets a little bigger. But right now, this is what he's in. And you hear the crickets? They're hiding. He'll chase them down here in a minute. And there is one other cat. I have to go find her. She likes to stay hidden. Oh, I hear her. Are you ready? This is Monkey. Yes, monkey is, and that's Gibbs. Very vocal. Um, monkey is our um, oldest cat. She is pushing fourteen, I think now. Put y'all back up on the stand. Okay. Um. Yes, yeah, she's pushing about fourteen, and we got her. She was one when we got her. She was two when we got her. Um, we got her from an animal shelter. Uh, her name was already Monkey. That's why her name doesn't really have a theme. Harley's name does not have a theme either because we um, got him from a friend who bought him and then just couldn't take care of him. So, my husband showed up at the door one day with him. Moose, his original name was Copper. We got him when he was five months old. Um, his owner was not ready did not educate themselves on the doodle breeds um so they didn't give the time or the effort to train him properly and we got him um for a little to nothing compared to what the labradoodles usually cost um, and then my Bernadoodle here, my 
mother-in-law. Hey, Susan. Um, she bought him, and he was a puppy. And then she just wasn't made for indoor pets. She loves him. She loves him that he's here at our house. But she just was not made for pets and that's fine because she brought him to me and I love him he's my baby so thank you Susan I love him so much um he is my big baby he zero zero regards to personal space does not care so that is our family of pets um my son does have a fish but I will not put y'all through the chaos of what is his room um it's a beta his name's Dory. That's just what he named it. Um, so those are our pets. And with this being about pets, I would like to take a moment and um, please, please, please get your pets spayed and neutered. Please. Um, most, most, not all, most um, animal shelters do... It's not free, but it's reduced um, spays and neuters for cats and dogs. Um, I think they do it once a year, maybe. Maybe twice a year. Um, so, please, 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 please get them spayed and neutered. Because I see so many cats running around here that don't have homes. Because at some point, there is a responsible, an irresponsible pet owner. Now, if you breed animals, of course, don't get them spayed and neutered. That's completely your choice if that's what you want to do. Um... I got stuff on my shirt from his paw. But anyway, those are our pets. And I did research on every single breed. I recommend doing research on every single breed. And if you are adopting, which I highly recommend adopting, um, because I I have a soft spot for soft spot for strays. If you adopt and it is a mixed breed. Do research on both those breeds because they're going to end up with traits from both those breeds. So please be responsible pet owners, guys. I cannot stress this enough. I love my pets. They are my fur babies. I I don't know what I'd do without them and I'm going to tear up because I'm a big baby. But please, you guys, be responsible pet owners. Do your research. Okay? And with that being said, we were going to end this video and I um, hope this answers all your questions. I hope you all like these videos. Um, just go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you do. And I will see you on my next video, which will be a Dollar Tree haul. So, bye guys.